Introduced in 1998 at the Geneva Motor Show, the E39 generation of the M5 was the first M5 to use a V8 engine, resulting in an increase in power output to 294 kilowatts, 400 PS, dot, 37. It is also the first M5 to use aluminium front suspension components and a multi-link rear suspension. Production began in October 1998. Production totaled to 20,482 cars from 1999 to 2003. Unlike its predecessors, the M5 was produced on the same assembly line as the regular 5 Series models at the Dingolfing factory in Germany. The official performance figures are 0 to 97 km per hour, 60 miles per hour, acceleration time of 4.8 seconds and an electronically limited top speed of 250 km per hour, 155 miles per hour, dot, 38, 39, in testing, an unrestricted M5 reached a top speed in excess of 300 km per hour, 186 miles per hour, dot, 40, the E39 M5 recorded a Nürburgring lap time of 8 to 20, 38. The M5 received the September 2000 facelift, for the 2001 model year, at the same time as the standard E39 models, 41, changes included halogen, corona rings, in headlights, often called angel eyes, LED tail lights and various interior upgrades. The mechanical specification was unchanged. For the subsequent two model years, changes were limited to the addition of new exterior colors, from September 2001, and the upgrade to a DVD-based navigation system, from September 2002.41. Production of a Touring Wagon Slash Estate E39 M5 model was evaluated by BMW, and at least one prototype was developed, in titanium silver with a black exclusive leather interior. However the Touring did not reach production, due to financial considerations, 42. Engine. The E39 M5 is powered by the BMW S62 V8 engine, which generates a power output of 294 kilowatts, 400 PS, 394 horsepower, at 6,600 RPM and 500 Nm, 369 lbft, of torque at 3,800 RPM, 36, 43. The S62 engine has electronically actuated individual throttle bodies, an aluminium block and heads, variable valve timing, double vanos, and a semi-dry sump oil system. Drivetrain The transmission is the Getrag 420G 6-speed manual, as used in the E39 540i but with an upgraded clutch due to the increased torque. The differential uses a shorter 3.15 to 1 ratio, and it has a limited slip differential with 25% maximum locking. Chassis The E39 M5 uses aluminium-intensive McPherson strut front suspension and multi-link rear suspension, as per the other V8 models of the E39 5 series range. However, several changes were made by BMW M, reduced spring height, 23 mm, 0.9 in, lower. A specific shock valving, thicker front and rear anti-roll bars, polyurethane auxiliary springs, and steel ball joints. Although the six-cylinder E39 models use rack and pinion steering, the M5, and other V8 models, retains the recirculating ball steering system, as used by previous generations of the M5. A quicker steering ratio of 14.7 was used, compared with 17.9 for other V8 models. 41. It featured a servotronic vehicle speed sensitive power assist which provides two levels of resistance controlled via console mounted sport button. The sport button also adjusted the electronic throttle butterflies for more sensitive response. 44. Brake discs, rotors, are a floating two-piece design, except for US and Canada models, for reduced risk of cone distortion. Their lower unsprung weight improves ride quality and traction on bumpy surfaces as well. The front discs are 345 millimeters, 
13.58 in, in diameter and the rear discs are 328 mm, 12.91 in, in diameter, 36. The E60 M5 was introduced in 2004, with a V10 engine and 7-speed paddle shift SMG, sequential manual gearbox, transmission linking the car with the BMW Sauber Formula 1 program, 47, 48. The E60 M5 was the world's first production sedan to use a V10 gasoline engine. This generation of the M5 was also built in the E61 Touring, wagon, body style, which was only sold in Europe. The E63 E64 M6 coupe and convertible are based on a shortened version of the M5 chassis and largely use the same mechanical components. The official 0 to 100 km per hour, 62 miles per hour, acceleration figure is 4.7 seconds for the sedan, 49, however magazine tests have recorded figures down to 4.1 seconds, 50. The E60 M5 was the fastest four-door sedan available at the time of its introduction wink with a frown 51. Top speed is electronically restricted to 250 km per hour. 155 miles per hour, 49, but could be raised to 305 km per hour, 190 miles per hour, with the optional M driver's package. 52, the M5 has recorded a Nürburgring lap time of 8 to 13, 53, 54. Upgrades over regular 5 series models include a wider track, unique body panels, a colorful heads up display featuring navigation control messages, speed, RPM and gear selection information, automated seat side bolsters, heated slash ventilated seats and power rear curtain. The larger, flared front guards on either side also featured cooling vents, reminiscent of the 1970s BMW CSL. The wheels were of 19-inch diameter and the car has quad exhaust pipes at the rear. During its five-year production run, 20,589 units were built, 19,564 sedans and 1,025 touring. The biggest market was the United States with 8,800 cars, sedans only, followed by Great Britain and Ireland with 1,776 cars and Germany with 1,647 cars, 55. The M5 model was designed by Carl John Elmet, 56 and produced at the BMW plant Dingolfing in Germany. The E60 M5 did not offer safety features such as automatic radar braking or lane departure warning, which was offered on the E65 series that were not on the M5. The BMW S85 is a 5.0L, 305CU in, V10 engine which generates a power output of 373 kilowatts, 507 PS, 500 horsepower, at 7,750 rpm and 520 nm, 384 lbft, of torque at 6,100 rpm. 49, 57, the S85 was exclusively used in the E60 M5, and related E63 E64 M6, and is not based on any other engine. There are three driver selectable engine modes. P400, P500 and P500S, P400, the default startup mode, limits the engine to 294 kilowatts, 400 PS, 394 horsepower. P500 increases power to the full 373 kilowatts, 507 PS, 500 horsepower. The P500S mode keeps the engine at the same power output as the P500 mode but adds a more sensitive throttle response, 58. This engine is well known for its rod bearing failures, the stock bearings not providing sufficient clearance, the S65 from the E9X series M3, being based on the S85, shares the issue, which can lead to catastrophic engine failure if it is not addressed. Another major issue with this engine is the throttle actuators, which is usually attributed to the gears located inside the actuators, however, electronic failure of the actuators themselves is not uncommon, 59. 
https colon slash slash en dot wikipedia dot org slash wiki slash bmw underscore m5 number sign colon tilde colon text equal sign transmission percent sign 5 baity t comma in percent sign 20 other percent sign 20 regions